budget cuts could have a major impact on where you go and when if you use public transportation in Lynchburg. 10 News reporter Magdala Lusant spoke with riders about how losing just two bus drivers could affect their routes and how the city is trying to keep this from happening. Dexter White is one of the 2,500 people who ride Lynchburg buses every day. Hey! Over the years, he's also developed a friendship with the drivers. We can't afford to lose Paul. He's, he's one of the friendliest drivers. He has a good rapport with the, drive, I mean, the riders. At the request of city leaders, the Greater Lynchburg Transit Company was asked to make cuts in its budget. GLTC's total budget is $8.2 million. Transportation leaders say the city's portion includes $1.6 million, and cutting 5% of that would mean... In order to make the budget balance, um, we had to factor in the elimination of two driver positions, which would result in a reduction of service to the city. Brian Booth with GLTC says they don't know which routes would see changes yet. We don't anticipate having to cut entire routes, but um, a particular route may not start as early or run as late in the day. With 65 drivers on payroll, Booth tells me they're currently understaffed with five vacant positions. We aren't anticipating having to eliminate staff or lay off. Um, we would just absorb vacant positions is really what we're looking at. If they lose two drivers, that's going to make it even worse because I've seen days where the supervisors had to um, run a route, drive a route until um, you know a driver came in. While GLTC waits for state and federal dollars to roll in later this month, they hope to have a balanced budget by this summer and not make any cuts. Riders who could be hurt by the impact say they need to add service, not cut service. In Lynchburg, Magdala Lusant, 10 News, working for you.